Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome to Battle Stations Midway. Brand new Let's Play I'm going to be starting up. And today, hopefully... Oh, there's no intro cutscene. Okay, maybe there is here in a second. But this uh, should be going up um, on the same day that the latest episode of Naval Apps Commander is going up, I believe, in theory. So that should be interesting. And uh, Battle Station Midway is a game that I have beaten before. I haven't gotten gold in every single mission. I wasn't really trying that much, but I have beaten it before, so I at least know what to expect. And um, as far as how I plan to record these episodes, I'm going to do them on a per-mission basis, one at a time. So regardless of how long or short the episode is, we're just going to do one mission per episode, and that'll keep it nice and simple, so we'll have, what, 11 episodes of this, I believe? Um, so, yeah. Uh, all that said, let's go ahead and jump right into it with uh, the first mission stationed at Pearl, like so. Oh, here we go. So we got some, some things here. Uh, get to the USS Phoenix. That's our only objective that we can see right now. And here is our history lesson. You can pause this and read it if you like. There's our order of battle. And uh, all that said, let's go ahead and get started. And we'll play on regular because... I'm not super hardcore. I don't feel like I need to prove anything by playing on veteran. So, we should keep it on normal difficulty. And I'm not ashamed to lower it to rookie if we're having too much trouble with the mission. I, no shame. Nope. I play games to have fun, not to not to make it frustrating. <laughs> After I finish the let's play of this game, I plan to do Battle Stations Pacific as well. So, In late 1941, Japanese forces had massed in Southeast Asia. On December 6th, President Roosevelt sent a personal note to the Emperor of Japan, appealing to him to cease warmongering. This son of man has just sent his final message to the Son of God. Ominous. It's been great to see you again, Doc. You too, Henry. I still say you owe me ten bucks. I still say the race ain't over yet. Technically, I'm a higher rank than you already. That's only because you Marine pilots have a command structure that's a lot less demanding than the rest of the U.S. Navy. Besides, you're in the war. I'm not. That ain't a fair contest. Always an excuse. You know you've been overpromoted. As soon as I am able, I will enable subtitles as well. somewhere in the Pacific. Here's hoping. If they ever let us off this damn island. Alrighty, let's turn on subtitles real quick. Options, game... No, this one, this one, no, this one What, what? Oh, oh, it's giving me examples. Okay, I see. Uh, yeah, I didn't change anything, but sure. Um, I want to find subtitles. Game... Ah, here we go. Enabled. Here we go. Yes. I'll, I'll do my best to be quiet when people are talking, but just in case something goes wrong, uh, I'll put the subtitles up so that... They're there for everyone to see. Okay. Welcome aboard, sir. Where to? Maddie, sailor. 
Battleship Row, the Phoenix. By the way, playing this, playing this on the 360, Xbox 360. So if I don't know, I'm not one for graphics or anything. I don't talk about, I don't care, care that much. So for me, it's not a big deal. But for anyone that does care, yes, this is the 360. If anyone out there is watching every single pixel, like that one looks different than what I'm playing on the PC. Well, yes, I'm playing on Xbox 360. Man, I can't morning, shoot sir. my guns yet. Best time of the day. Makes Pearl look like the world's biggest boating pond. I'm not Makes gonna say this game is uh on the right, sir. Don't worry, sailor. I know where I'm going. I'm not gonna say this game is completely historically accurate a simulator. It's pretty good. I mean, it's it's pretty close on a lot of things, but it's not exactly uh historical simulator that you can like bring to your history professor and say this is how it was yeah eh, not really it does pretty good though it does it does pretty good so there's that like I'm not sure if we had Atlanta class cruisers um, at this point in the war that doesn't even look exactly like an Atlanta class because it doesn't have the other 5 inch gun mount on on the sides of the ship Amidships, so I don't even know. My name is Henry Walker. I'm currently a U.S. Naval Lieutenant on the USS Phoenix. All my life, I wanted to follow my father's footsteps, be a Navy man. Now that I'm here, well, it just ain't what I hoped it would be. Then again, they say be careful what you wish for. Let's not be a sitting target. Incoming enemy aircraft. Okay, just because I'm curious. We are coming on a enemy uh, Get those 50 cals CL8, which uh, if you looked at our ship that we were going towards there, is actually the USS Detroit. Uh, so, yeah, like I said, it's not perfect, but it, I mean, it does pretty good. I saw one guy covering this game um, and I don't remember who it was so yeah but uh, he basically he made one of the one of these comments and I was just like what are you talking about and it made it made me click off the video immediately something along the lines of oh get the guns up when, when our guy says get the guns up or whatever he was like something along the lines of yeah because there was definitely a lot of strafing going on at Pearl Harbor and you could tell he was being like sarcastic like he actually thought there wasn't a lot of strafing going out at Pearl Harbor, which there definitely was. Zeros and everything strafed airfields and everything they could they could possibly strafe to disrupt us. Airfields and everything else. Um, now they didn't strafe oil, oil uh, drums and supplies because they were specifically told not to because it would create a lot of smoke and they wouldn't be able to see their targets and identify them positively. So. Yeah, there's that. Um, I don't think I'm going to be going for gold medals in all of these missions, because, I, to be honest, I don't know what the requirements are for that uh, off the top of my head, so there's not much point in trying to go for something that I don't know how to go for, so there's that. In the future, I'll probably look it up before I do these. Um, I think in this mission, if I remember correctly, it's just shoot down 30 planes. Uh, that, that could be totally wrong, but I, that's what I remember it to be. As far as the rest of these missions, I don't remember, so I'll probably look it up um, beforehand and just and try to go for it, but I can't guarantee that we're going to get it every single time. So. Sir, bears look to aft! Mini summon our harbor gentlemen! Prep the ash cans! Run that son of a bitch out of here! In the water, sir. Over there. Okay. Let's uh 
before we do that, we're gonna actually, before we deal with the submarine, we're gonna actually shoot down a couple more planes to try and get the hidden objective. Whoa, battleship. 39. 39. That's not, no. That, that's not Arizona. Um, 39. Is that, well, it's a New York class, so it's either the New York or the Texas. Uh, I don't know which one is which, but, uh, yeah. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. You're, you're so close to being dead. There we go. Okay. Basically, I just want to try and shoot down more planes so that I know that we have the hidden objective done. So that I can positively say, yes, we did that. Um, let's keep shooting at the incoming planes because they're much easier to hit. These zeros would not be... Well, these aren't... Those are valves, but zeros would not be taking as much fire as they do in this game. They they go up like matchboxes when you even throw a rock in their general direction. They have no armor to speak of, and their fuel tanks are completely unsealed and everything, so... Come on. Come on. I think we got that one. That one is still live, though. Um, let's, let's keep trying, I guess. Oh, look, a zero. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? You, you would absolutely... Are you dead now? Oh, whoa, 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 what am I doing? Ah! Watch where you're driving, kids. Okay, we're gonna have to just... We're gonna have to just reverse out of this one, because... Yeah. Alright, I guess we'll reverse like so, because what I was going to try to do is not gonna work. Don't, don't mind our own crane, or our own dock, or our own anything. It's, it's fine. We don't... We don't really need those anyways. We'll just blast them with our own machine gun fire. Okay, now that we're out of there, let's let's start going the right direction again. Where are? Th Come on now. I can see the red all over the mini map, but I can't actually see most of the planes coming in. Oh, here we go. Here's a bunch. Alright, I guess we'll go for that submarine, wherever he is, there he is. Um, I don't know if we've shot down 30 planes, but in any case, the hidden objective is shoot down 30 planes. I don't know if we did it, but we're gonna get on with this and, uh, and actually do the mission. So... Boy, oh boy. I know there were a lot of planes at Pearl Harbor, but I don't think there were actually this many. Also, I'm pretty sure they didn't quite lose 30 planes at Pearl Harbor. I think they lost, like, somewhere in the high 20s. Is this, uh, submarine really that fast? What? Is he all the way over there? Oh my goodness. I don't think midget subs are that fast, either. He's kind of outrunning a PT boat right now, which... I don't think a midget sub could outrun a PT boat. Or any sub, for that matter. Let's... let's... Shoot that one down. Oh, uh, I guess not, huh? Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, let's let's actually get this guy now. Hey, buddy! Uh, wait for it now. Two depth charges on a midget sub? Yeah, I was about to say that should be plenty. All right, there's that. I don't think we're quite done with the mission yet, either. We've been marked. Banded at six o'clock. Get the guns up.
the character banter in this game doesn't really add to the experience of the game, in my opinion, but, eh, what are you gonna do? Oh, my controls are not inverted. Hold on, that's not gonna, that's not gonna work. Controls. Uh, plane control inverted. Yes. I need invite uh, inverted flight controls. Ah, here we are. Let's, let's, I'm not great at the flying in this game, so don't don't make too harsh of uh, judgments. Okay, these guys are uh, significantly faster. Whoopsies! I'm used to Battle Station specific, where if you click in left stick, it automatically pushes your throttle to the maximum. Uh, and if you hold it, you can even get a boost in, in most planes. Not the case in this game. Come on, come on. I'm in range, I know I am, because the crosshair is different. Come, come on. Eh. There we go. Come on. Uh, let's go for this one that's almost dead. Oh, we got that one. Cool. Oh, yeah, there we go. <coughs> I had to look away to cough, so... Let's... Yeah. There we go. Let's slow ourselves down a little here. That one's down. Also, I don't think we would have been able to see Japanese carriers just in, in, in chasing them with a P-40 Warhawk. I don't think we would have gotten this close to the carriers in real life. Pretty sure we didn't. But, uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure if I turn around and look the other direction, we can actually see Pearl from here. Can we? Mm, so, well, no, okay, this is actually, I mean, as far as the distance between the carriers and Pearl, it seems right, but I don't think we would have flown out here with P-40s all the way out here just to chase these guys back to the carrier. I don't know, they didn't, maybe that did happen, I don't know. It just seems very unlikely. Alrighty. Oh, I did it again. This is not battle station specific. Oh. You're not going home. Yeah. I mean, I, I may have missed you that time, but I, I will get you. You're not going to be able to land in a, a flurry of fire like we are giving you. I did it again. I'll, uh, I'll get used to not doing that at some point, I promise. Look at how little health you have, man. Like, why are you still up? Go down. Go... You're not, you're not landing on that carrier. There you go. Um, I don't think I have ever played this mission and gotten this close to the ships because I've never done this badly at shooting these guys down. Again, zero. Should be going up like a box of matches. Whoa! Did, did we get him? What happened there? What's our objective exactly? I don't know. What is it? I don't know how to check. Whatever. I know it's just shoot down a bunch of planes, but I'm wondering how many. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Yes. Are we, how many more do we... Oh, oh, okay. Are we done yet, or no? Kaga, Savami... I don't want to target the ships, I want to target the planes. What the... No, oh, that looked oddly like an American destroyer for a second there. Really confused. What is in front of me? Oh, here we go. Zeros. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, that wouldn't happen in any other part of the game. In any other part of the game, I would have just lost my plane right there. And because this guy is a special pilot, he, he has a special plane that is better than everyone else's plane. This is a uh, much more of a struggle than it usually is for me. I don't know why. Oh, okay, okay, he's dead. I mean, we got all the ships, right? Yeah, okay. All the ships? No, I meant all the planes. I was like, this is weird. It hasn't done yet. No more Japanese planes. Uh, let's see what's next. That, I think that's actually the end of the mission. It's, it's giving us the typical camera music thing here. I think we I think we're good. All right. 
Yesterday, December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy, the United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. Also launched an attack against Malaya, Hong Kong, Guam, the Philippine Islands, Weak Island, Midway Island. As Commander-in-Chief of the Army and Navy, I have directed that all measures be taken for our defense. Skipper, take us 10 degrees to port. This man had his own god and his own family. Why would he attack us? I ask that the Congress declare that since the unprovoked and dastardly attack by Japan on Sunday, December 7th, 1941, a state of war has existed between the United States and the Japanese Empire. My country's going to war. I'm going with it. Alrighty, let's see how we did. I wonder if we got the hidden objective. I'm thinking we probably did, but I don't know. We'll find out. Here's our little news article, and uh, let's see. Silver! Okay, we we did not shoot down 30 planes. Oh well, that's fine. Um, yeah, they didn't actually lose that many planes in, in Pearl Harbor. But, eh, whatever, it's a video game, it doesn't have to be perfect. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, enemy units killed. Let's see, it looks like we got what, 21, 23, 20, well, 23 planes. Yeah, so that's fine. I think that'll be, if I, oh, here we go, one more turn of the pages. Oh, we got a ribbon, we got some of this stuff. All right, if I hit continue, will it, where will it take us? Oh, okay, this is the next mission. Um, so, we'll start that at a later time, right there, Defense of the Philippines. We'll do that next time in Battle Stations Midway. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope my sniffling and everything was not too annoying. But uh, thank you for watching nonetheless, and I'll see you in the next episode of Battle Stations Midway.